Ripple XRP could rise 1,360% hitting $7 The cryptocurrency boom in December 2017 and January 2018 injected cryptocurrencies into the mainstream. Popular news outlets were flooded with news about the price of Bitcoin. Yes, whilst Bitcoin did see some impressive momentum, other cryptocurrencies such as Ripple XRP actually managed to make more of an impact. Despite only moving up to a value of $3.65, which, as it stands, still refers to an all time high value for Ripple XRP. Incredibly, during this time, Ripple XRP managed to climb 1,360%, from an initial price that averaged out at around 25 cents. Therefore, we want to refer back to this time and see how Ripple XRP would fare. If another cryptocurrency boom of this nature hit the markets, which, is indeed a possibility. Before I continue, please remember that this is not investment advice, this is entirely based on speculation. Ripple XRP could indeed rise 1360% again, however it would take absolutely perfect market conditions, conditions that are ultimately very hard to come by. Nonetheless. It is important to consider how future market surges could affect today's prices. At the time of writing, Ripple XRP is valued at 48 cents. Therefore, a rise of 1,360% would see Ripple XRP hit $7, a very achievable figure, but a very distant figure at that. As mentioned, this would rely on perfect market conditions. But moreover, I think increased Ripple XRP adoption could also contribute to this. If Ripple XRP became a more integrated part of something like, Santander's one app, for example, then we could very well see the value of the currency rise significantly. Tie this in with a good market and of course, other positive announcements, we could very well see Ripple XRP, surpass $5, hitting new heights, leading a very positive trajectory as a result. When will this happen? We can't really be sure. The markets are almost positive to predict. This simply just aims to highlight the potential for growth that is harnessed by Ripple XRP. The currency is very undervalued at the moment for a number of reasons so, therefore when the markets take off again, Ripple XRP will once more benefit most from this. Hopefully, this happens tomorrow, and we can all relish in the glory of XRP. Realistically though, we may be waiting some time before we see Ripple XRP at $7. For now, we'll just have to wait and see. Top 3 Bitcoin, Ethereum and Ripple, getting back key levels but still lacking confidence technical indicators are pointing to a bullish movement in the next hours for Bitcoin and Ethereum Ripple and Ethereum have touched extreme levels, drilling yesterday's levels cryptocurrencies are finally seeing some green figures today after touching meaningful supports again yesterday. Today's 4 hour charts show the first sizable bullish candles after accumulated falls around 20% during the last 10 days. It looks like the outlook is positive in the short term, with some small possibilities of developing some more bullish legs in the midterm. Still, the main scenario continues to be fully bearish as we haven't reached yet technical levels that might indicate a change of trend. Bitcoin has recovered the $6,400 level lost yesterday finally taking a breather after many days of consecutive falls. Asian trading brought some relief to the bulls after another bearish American session. BTC, USD is trading just below the superior trend line of the bearish channel that is located at $6,570. Breaking above that barrier would indeed bring some more optimism, and bulls could finally see some light at the end of the tunnel. On the upside, we see a first price congestion resistance at $6,830, where it will probably end up meeting the 50 EMA. 
The target of this bullish action will be the $7,500 mark, but to reach it, Bitcoin will need to first clear the $7,100 mark, the 100 SMA at $7,300 and another price congestion resistance at $7,400. This is a tough battlefield for the bulls. On the downside, there are clear levels to watch for. Yesterday's low at $6,129.75 is a critical point which, if broken, would again trigger high levels of anxiety among bulls. Don't expect any meaningful action to the downside until that level is breached, though. If that finally happens and those lows are lost, the primary bearish target will be at $5,850, February 3rd low. Magdalen the Bitcoin 4-hour chart is slightly crossed to the upside, so the underlying force in the short term is bullish. Big room to cover to the upside that will probably be accompanied by quick falls to unnerve traders. Directional movement index in the same chart is confirming this situation, with sellers still at high levels and with some distance over the buyers. The current scenario draws a progressive increase of the bulls, coupled with falls in the selling levels. ADX is relaxing some, but still at pretty high levels, so any bearish movement might be strong. Ethereum is also getting back the critical level lost yesterday at $480 and is now trying to consolidate the price congestion level at $485. Above there, there are multiple barriers, starting with a meaningful trend line at $505, followed by a price congestion resistance at $520 and a 50 EMA that will probably hover around that level. The main target of the current movement is at $550, from where we might draw a bullish scenario in the midterm. On the downside, we can find a weak support at $480, but the most important level to watch is at yesterday's lows, at $449.78. Below there, anxiety levels might be triggered with big falls down until the $400-$350 area. Magdalen the Ethereum 4-hour chart is also crossed to the upside, with room for a bullish development. The fact that this indicator is moving alongside the negative side of the indicator is warning us about some potential falls after each bullish leg. Directional movement index in the same chart is also showing how sellers have taken control of the situation, while buyers follow the price but don't lead to any rises. There is no confidence and you can tell that seeing that any levels that are taken back don't trigger any immediate bullish continuation. Ripple fell down yesterday until the support located at $0.5042, where it turned to the upside to get back in the opening level at $0.55. Cents. A 20% accumulated move in just 24 hours. If the low reached yesterday is lost, next support will be at February's lows at $0.45. Cents. On the bullish side, the first target has already been met at the mentioned 55 cents level. Following targets will be located at the price congestion resistance at $0.585, where it will probably meet the 50 EMA. Further above, another price resistance at 60 cents and the primary target at the 200 SMA, trading around 64 cents. Magdalen the Ripple 4-hour chart is crossed to the upside with some good inclination and with room to cover until reaching the equilibrium level. Bullish potential but with possible falls as the indicator is still in negative territory. Directional movement index in the same chart shows how sellers are controlling the market. They have diminished their strength a bit, but the meaningful move is coming from the buyers, that have reacted and are growing after a bit of a consolidation in the last 4 hours.